Okay, so we went to the 99 cent store, King Dollar, Aldi, and Kroger today. Six and a half hours of fun. Um, you saw part one, that was Walgreens, and just me kind of explaining a little bit. I do not have any of the food to show you that I got from Aldi, Kroger, or the 99 cent store, because 90% of that is put up, and 10% of it is still trying to find room. Yeah. Um, but I got things from 99 cent store, um... Everything there is 99 cents unless it's otherwise marked. So some of the food items I got was bananas because they were 39 cents. I was like, oh my gosh. So between me and my ex, I, I, don't, I don't know what to call him. Soon to be ex? Uh, just weird. They were 39 cents. So we got like four pounds and it was still only $1.58. So that was pretty, pretty cool. Then grapes were 99 cents a pound. So he got him some grapes. Um, he got him some chips and some, apparently some popcorn. Oh, and something else that was pretty amazing, and he got two of, because I told him he could keep one in my icebox. They had the Simply Orange, the regular bottle that is in our grocery store, our HEB and our Walmart, for like three or four bucks. They had them there for 99 cents. So, let me see. Does see? course not anyway so simply orange so that was pretty cool i got a couple of things that were marked down that i can show you my son surprisingly wanted strawberries so i got him some strawberries for 99 cents a pound oh one thing i was amazed at they had craft miracle whip for 99 cents the big jar i was like uh yes please i grabbed two of those those will stay on my shelf um my son in addition to wanting strawberries he wanted the haribo gummies for 99 cents i was just like Hmm, are you kidding me? I can get, like, well, no, that is right, because at five and below, I can get them five for five. So, yeah, I guess that's right. Um, some other stuff I can show you. Um, he got M&M Easter thing. I'm not sure where they went. I got some grated Parmesan cheese for 99 cents, just because we need that for tomorrow. Um, he got, apparently, some canola spray. I got some stuff for salad, some, um... Crispy onions and wontons, they were 99 cents for, like, the big bags that I spend two bucks for at Walmart. Yeah. Um, my son also wanted pudding. I'm not sure what that's about, but he got pudding. Uh, and carrots, he wanted baby carrots, too. They were all 99 cents. And that bag that I bought, um, I think it was a pound, is, like, $1.50 at HEB. So, yeah, whatever. Got three pounds of potatoes for 99 cents. Um... That's some more stuff I can show you. And I thought... There's a couple of things on here that are miscellaneous other... Um, I don't know. I got him a toy for $1.99. It was a... Uh, it's a finger puppet. It's a Guardian of the Galaxy. He was hoping to get Groot, but he got Ronin, I think. Um, one of the other things I got was... I guess that's one of the miscellaneous items um was onions for 99 cents so yeah i thought that was pretty cool so let me, let me show you the items that i got now because my son wanted to eat the freaking um pudding in the truck i wanted to get him some spoons and these are actually big soup spoons and um i've been wanting some bigger spoons to eat stuff with when we're on the go so I thought these would be perfect you get um, 45 of those um, I got this grass because this is a huge honking bag for 99 cents um, it's not like that cheap stuff I know that might still even be a little bit expensive but oh well I got this huge thing of eggs for 99 cents, there are, um, two, three, six, nine, twelve, eighteen there. I got this because I thought this was pretty cool. Um, it's an auto headrest hanger. So you, um, put it on the back and then you can hook stuff so it's not like on the floor and whatnot. And then it can stay up. So I thought that was pretty cool. I thought I'd give that a try. This was pretty cool. I've never seen these before. These are pen, 
big pins for kids. So what this is, is in here is a guide that will help them do their finger position. And since he has um, such problems with writing and holding stuff, I thought I would get him there. And there is more stickers, apparently. Um, that you could put your name on it. So I got him two of those um, just to see what they are. One of the things I got, and I think I threw the wrapper away, was... Um, they had plus keychains, and I was really hoping to get the poop, but I got the crying emoji. It's a keychain. I'll just hook it to something. Um, two sets of orange in case we do do something for his party, even if it's at the house. Um, along with his party, I was going to do, because it's a construction theme, I was going to have them do a craft where they use marshmallows and toothpicks and then just make whatever they wanted to. But the two big things kind of freaked me out a little bit. And I'm not sure everybody can A, eat marshmallows, or B, would like marshmallows. So I saw these big um, 25 packs of polystone. So I got one pack of those. Um, and because it's kind of near Easter, um, I thought we could also... Um, it's, if we do something... Ugh, it's such a hard weekend. Easter's so late, and we run into this every couple years. Um... Because his birthday is April 17th, which is Monday. April 16th is Sunday. And then the 15th Saturday, you know, typically when people do it. But because it's the weekend and kids are usually off Friday for Good Friday, nobody's there. So I don't know what we're doing. But I got some eggs in case they want to do something just to throw that in. Um, I also got some smaller ones um, to construct. And like I said, because the two picks freaked me out, I was so happy when I found these. These are an 80 pack of colored dowels. They're really thin. Um, they could use these. We could probably even cut these. And then I got the longer natural 85 pack of dowels. Um, so we could paint them. We could whatever. Um, to do Easter, if I do stuff with my son for Easter or um, with a friend, I wanted to get some kind of boy and girl you know, gender kind of whatever, batch, cello bag. So I thought this would be kind of pleasing to everybody. Um, in case we do move, I want to get some rags that I can kind of just clean with and throw away. So these are six of the white pocket rags. These things are probably huge, but um, they're thin enough to clean with and just throw away. And then I'll say that for last oh because like I said my soon-to-be ex I don't know what's going on with that um he always fixes my son's bike with all his wrenches and I don't have any of that and I thought instead of just getting one wrench I saw this it's a bicycle wrench I thought that might be pretty interesting I don't know these were on markdown um for 24 70 24.75. Um, they're 19 by 12 by 5. They are white boxes. I am notorious for not for putting everything into bags or putting everything in boxes and just throwing a ribbon on it. Um, I was thinking Christmas, birthday. I don't know. I only got two because they're a little. They're the jumbo ones, so they are a little bit bigger than the ones I normally get. I got this 99 cent bag because we had brought. Of two bags in and this was the first stop we did I didn't want to use all my bags the 99 cent store so I just went ahead and got this huge huge amazing bag for 99 cents so yeah got that what else I needed some more of these strainer ones for the kitchen I'm hoping those will fit and then these I could always use in the bathroom um, so I've never seen a pack that actually had the strainers and these. Normally I see these or just these. So this was an interesting little pack. But non the nonsense. 99 cent store, even though it does say 99 cent only store. Yes, it is 99 cent store as long as it doesn't have a yellow sticker on it. If it has a yellow sticker on it, like a dollar ninety nine, two ninety nine. I think the most I've seen maybe seven ninety nine. Maybe, maybe just five ninety nine. Um, then, you know, that's the price. And then if you don't see a yellow sticker, then it's, you know, 
not any sense. So some other stuff. I got another orange. I'm hoping this orange will go with that orange because I've been buying orange every freaking where. Um, I saw some white 3D looking butterflies. I think I've seen them sold at Walmart before, but you only got three of them. And they were just white. These are seven of these. And um, you get four different styles of them. I just thought these were so freaking pretty to put somewhere. Maybe if I get a new home. Um, oh, this, I didn't throw this away. This is what that pack looked like. It looked like that, and those are the ones that you could have gotten. So, yeah, that was pretty fun. And then, oh, I don't know, to do, well, packing tape. And then, I don't know, thought about taking this yellow tape and taking some of this and maybe having them construct stuff with this, like roadways or something. I don't know. I needed some more band-aids that had antibacterial on them, and these were 30 for the Coralite brand, so for 99 cents, yes. Okay, I got this bucket because it's getting summertime. My son likes to play outside. I thought this would be an easy bucket for him to use. It's got a nice handle. It's got a nice tilting spout. My favorite thing that I got was this Elmer shipping package tape. You get two rolls and this dispenser. I was thinking for moving, that was pretty freaking amazing for 99 cents. So yeah, that was the 99 cent store. Now, like I said at Aldi's, um, my prices did not seem to be near as cheap as what Illinois was or Houston area. Illinois, I think their freaking milk was like 80 cents for a gallon of milk. I, I don't know. They were just crazy. Um, I did get some good deals. Um, like their um, uh, pork chops. It was like a four pound of pork chops for $6.89. So I thought that was really good. Um, a five pound thing of 73% lean ground meat for 10 bucks. I thought that was pretty good. Naval oranges. I think they were two pounds for $1.29. My boyfriend, my ex soon to be got those. I said the eggs were 95 cents um some crackers for 89 cents just some random just some randomness and then kroger's was nothing really special um it was powerade i got those for 49 cents and then we got a lot of good meat deals like some angus skirt like two pounds of angus skirt for like five bucks and then just a bunch of 10 for 10 stuff. He got olives. Oh, Kroger water. The 24 packs were two for five. We're low on water. That's the cheapest um, that we've seen. Um, just we got some spare ribs for six bucks. Tyson for $4.99. Oh, 10 for 10 on Totoni pizzas and then the Lunchables. That was a good deal. And then biscuits were 10 for 10. Peppers are two for a dollar. So I spent 132 and I saved 39 there. So not the greatest, but it was okay. So yes, this is already almost 14 minutes. I don't know if this will re stay recorded. Um, thank you if you are watching my haul. I will put this up with the other one and I will talk to you maybe later. Thank you if seriously if you are watching this. Bye.